Hello everyone, I'm Sasha Seumann, handstand guru. In this short episode, I will share with you few exercises I personally use to condition my body. Please remember to always warm up before any physical activity, especially before trying gymnastics, acrobatics or tumbling. Let's get started. So as I said, I'm going to give you just few very simple exercises you can safely practice at home or may maybe even in your office uh, on a lunch break. Let's start with our stomach exercises. Very basic crunches. Bend your knees at 90 degrees. Place your hands if you, behind your head or you can fold your hands on top of your chest. Lift your shoulders off the floor. Breathe them out. More advanced exercise is a sit-up when you end up in a sitting position. Your elbows at that point can touch your knees. Right. I suggest that you do this exercise three times, ten repetitions, a minimum. Try to get strong enough to increase that amount to three sets of 20. Another good exercise, a little bit more advanced for your stomach, V-ups. You start in a layout position, straight legs, straight arms. Contract your stomach, come into a V-seat and go back down. Avoid to fully relax your body between these reps. Keep your upper back slightly off the floor. Keep your heels slightly off, off the floor. Remember, breathe out when you contract. Same. To start with uh, three sets of 10. Get to three sets of 20. Push-ups, of course, push-ups. If you're just beginner, start with your knees. Find the placement for your hands where you can flatten your body, flatten your hips. Your body should be absolutely flat. Head is neutral. You can keep your elbows in. You can place them a little bit out. This detail is that doesn't really matter at this point. Right. More important, you can exercise with hands together. Your triceps. Shoulder width your shoulders and of course your triceps and wide hands elbows out your chest of course if you're strong enough perform all this this exercise in a proper plank position i'm going to show you one interesting variation of push-ups we as gymnasts do a lot mountain push-ups Start in a position that does look like a mountain. Bend your elbows touching the floor with your forehead and push against the floor, opening your shoulders. So avoid doing this. You've got to push slightly back each time, opening your shoulder angle. Very good. Thank you. I like to mix exercises. For example, I would always mix stomach work with my upper body. First of all, it saves time while my stomach is getting rest. I'm exercising my arms. So these two exercises I would do one after another. I would do set of V-ups and then set of push-ups. Rest for 30 seconds, one minute, repeat three times. One exercise that I mentioned uh, in my press to handstand video, tuck planche. Place your hands slightly behind your knees, push down against the floor, bringing your knees to your chest. Hold this for 10 seconds. Of course, I held a little bit less. I would like to keep our videos short. A little bit more advanced version of it is 
Start in the same way, but then raise your hips up, bringing your legs slightly behind you. Always give yourself proper amount of time for resting between the sets. Keep your wrist warm and flexible. Okay, that's it for today's video. Sorry, it's pretty short, three exercises, but we've got to start somewhere. In upcoming videos, I'll be sharing with you more tips and more ideas about how you can keep your body strong, flexible, and ready to turn itself upside down.